Hi, I'm Glenn from IFM Australia. I'm here with Freddie, our digitalisation and IoT expert. There's some misconceptions between condition-based monitoring and predictive maintenance. Can you tell us some insights? Yes, Len. Uh, so condition monitoring in itself is always looking at one single parameter, like vibration. And that uh, often uh, uh, shows you that your machine has started to degrade. Uh, but also that will sometimes stop you from a catastrophic failure, but that means your machine has already taken damage. Then on the flip side, you've got predictive maintenance. So that's all in the word predict. So what we are doing there is we have a holistic view of the entire asset. We take all the other parameters in consideration, like temperature, flow, pressure, the current of the machine, to then have a better picture if any of those conditions start to degrade, that you know way earlier that something has changed, then to intervene before it gets to that breakdown situation. Mm. So what tools are necessary for predictive maintenance? Well, we can keep it very simple, Glenn. In that case, all we need is smart sensors. Uh, then we need to take that to an IoT platform. And then we need smart analytic data on top of that, uh, like data science. Mm -hmm. So the IoT platform, why is it important? Well, Glenn, a simple word is visibility. Because what we are doing here, we want to give the business the visibility of the entire operation. We're typically, this information would typically go to a control system, which is typically isolated from the rest of the business. Where an IoT platform comes into play is why IFM has developed Monio. That means we can seamlessly collect data from the assets and then share that with the rest of the business after putting a lot of analytics and data science on top of the information. Thanks, Freddie. Great insights.